how to download leads from Facebook Ads Manager. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an amazing day. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how you can download leads from Facebook Ads Manager in the easiest way possible, okay? And uh, it's gonna be a pretty easy and pretty simple process, so please do make sure to fully watch this video till the end. Now, to download leads from Facebook Ads Manager, what you're gonna be doing is you're gonna make sure that you have a professional Facebook account and your meta business suite is set it up, okay, with your proper meta business ads and all. So basically, the reason you need this is because without the actual ads manager, or you know, at least your Instagram ads manager, you usually can't get the leads. So you usually get leads after running a leads objective campaign on meta platform or technology on this video. So I'm gonna cover on how you can uh, you know create a campaign, get those leads, and after you have those leads submitted with their information on your ad i'm going to show you how you can sample one of those ads as we did for a client so you could see you know what the lead ad looks like so basically to start things off you're going to come over to your facebook.com you know pretty much and straight up from here what you're going to do is uh, i assume that you have a meta business center and ads account now once you do that you're going to come here and uh, i'm going to switch to my business account that uh, you know i have so as you can see in this business account, I have different pages that uh, one can work with. You know, I have the ads manager and all, I have Meta Business Suite. So I'm gonna open up the Meta Business Suite right here to actually get into the ads manager. So this is my Meta Business Suite. It's set it up, it has its pixels. I've also connected my Instagram to this for a generation better following, if you know what I mean. So once you create this type of working for yourself, from there, what's gonna happen is uh, you're gonna get a general common idea of uh, you know what kind of working you're gonna want to go ahead and add for yourself so once we're over here we're gonna come into all tools on this side and once you come to all tools here you have ads or campaigns so obviously you can also go over to the ads manager which I'm gonna open up in this tab but I'm gonna go into ads to actually start creating campaigns you can also see your ad account from here so here you can see it says welcome loading your ad account and launches the ads manager so obviously it says get to set up running ads, confirm a few details in your account to overview your ads. So you can actually do that by coming here and click on ready to create your first ad, click on get started. Now once you click on get started here, it says create a new ad. So I'm gonna go ahead and create a new ad to show you guys how you're gonna create it from scratch. So here it brings you to create a new ad. What is your goal? So there could be many goals. First of all, there's a traffic goal where you can drive awareness by sending people to a destination such as, you know, your website, your Facebook page. You can also drive sales where you can drive engagement by connecting potential customers with your business or products. Now, every feature that you see over here works a bit differently. So let me show you how they work. Basically, once you have get more website visitors, so here they even give you examples. So get more website visitors, and this ad sends people to your website to learn about your business or product. So, you know, the example is, as you can see, uh, you create this. It says learn more, and people can learn more about your products. Then it has get more pages likes, where this ad lets people like your pages on Facebook. It's, uh, you know, an ad which just adds a like on the left right side to, you know, increase like generations. Then you have sales where you can get more messages and get the ads to send people to message you directly on messages, Instagram or WhatsApp or Messenger. Okay, and uh, they can message you directly regarding the ad that you have and then get more leads where this ad opens a form to let people share their contact information with you. Now, this is what we're generally going to go with if we want to, you know, actually get leads and download them. So I'm going to click on get more leads. And uh, once you click on get more leads, from here, they're gonna bring you here. Now, as you can see, there's a lot of things to take in from this section. So let me explain it all to you one by one. So obviously our whole goal is to grow customer base. So right under this customer base, you have ad creative and all. Now in ad creative, you can see, you know, how do you wanna start your ad to look? So you can use a post or you can create a post right now. And I'm gonna show you how you're gonna do that. Now over here, you're gonna choose the profile or the headline. So the headline, let's say I'm gonna go ahead with, um, you know, join now. Okay, I'm gonna do that. And then there's the button label. You can choose the button label of however you want it. Apply now, learn more, sign up. I'm gonna go ahead with sign up and I'm gonna create a form. You know, you can also create different forms uh, regarding the signups. So you can add form name, you know, and you can create basic templates 
for different form names for yourself. This all depends on the type of uh, form editing that you do. Okay, so uh, make sure that your form editing is on point. It's in general really good. And the whole working concept is good. Then you have your contact info. You're going to ask people to add that. And this is basically the actual idea and outlook of how the form is supposed to look. Then you have Advantage plus Creative, where you can leverage Facebook's data to automatically deliver different ad creative variations to people when they like to improve your performance. Then you have Special Ad Category, where ads about credit, employment, housing, or social issues, elections, or politics reflect what you do. Okay. And then you have Audience, where you it shows you who should actually see your ad. You can add a targeted audience for yourself, you know, whoever you want to target whoever you want to work with, and uh, a whole lot more. Then uh, moving on, you know, you get your durations and all. So you're going to go ahead and uh, create all of this uh, subliminally and create it properly. And once you do all of that, you're finally going to go ahead and click on submit. So once you click on submit, you're pretty much good to go. And uh, you get the whole general idea of how all of this works for you. And uh, once you're done with all of this, this is what your post is going to look like. Join now. And here's the sign up. Estimated daily results, it says this much, it says this much, this gives you your payment summary, you're going to choose the necessary settings, and once you do all of that, add any currency that you want. It also says that you need to add a payment method, you know, whatever payment method you want to add, so add a payment method to get your leads. Now once you get your leads in and you get your payment methods in, what you're going to do from there is, let me show you. Now. Once you're done with all of this, you're going to come to your ads manager where you can actually, you know, see all of your ads. Now, in the ads that you have over here, you can book different um, lead generations and you can book different assignments. So the leads you get over here, you're going to find them in the results tab. And uh, to actually download those leads or import those leads, you're obviously going to set a main income of how many leads you want to generate and how many leads you want to actually download. So to download your leads, what you're going to do is you're simply going to come back to your basic uh, meta business center. And uh, I'm just, uh, you know, going to go back to my meta business suite. Now, once you come to your meta business suite from there, let me show you how you're going to actually download your leads. So basically in the advertise form where, you know, you've created the form for leads, over there, you're simply going to go ahead oh, Wait, you're going to come to these analytics You come to the analytics, come to advertise. And here you can see your instant forms. You're going to click on this and the forms that you have are going to open up over here. And right beside this, it's going to say sharing where it's going to give you the download section. And you're just going to click on download to download any leads you want to go with. And that is basically how you can download leads from your Facebook in the easiest and most simplest ways possible. So that's pretty much about it for this video. Now, if you enjoyed watching, please do make sure to drop down a like and subscribe to this channel. And if you want to see more videos like this in the future, let me know down in the comments below and I'll be making more for you. Uh, but that's generally about it for this video. Thank you for watching and I'll see all of you next time. Goodbye.